Alrighty guys, welcome to home workout number 11. Still doing our, video, our class uh, video conferencing workouts. We'll be getting emails about the links, and text messages about the links. Hope you guys are enjoying them and joining. Today's workout, um, we have a Tabata. Tabata is eight rounds in a row of the same movement. Uh, it's gonna be four minutes total, 20 seconds work, 10 seconds rest. Your score is your lowest number of reps on each movement. Now, two of the movements are just kind of a pass-fail. Uh, it's not a score, it's can you hold the plank for the whole time. First movement, we are doing a single arm plank. So Cass is hitting her plank position, taking one arm, putting it behind her back. She's holding it eight rounds, 20 seconds on. You can rest for 10, come up on your knees, and we're going back on for 20 seconds, 10 seconds rest. Next movement, we have glute bridges. So Cass is on the floor. Just show a regular first. Uh, She's got her hands down by her side. She's gonna, you guys can make the call here. You can either pulse with the glute bridges or you can hold a glute bridge as hard as you want for the whole 20 seconds. So 20 seconds on, 10 seconds rest for eight rounds once again. If you're, if you're pulsing on the glute bridges, count your lowest round. If you want an RX plus, add a uh, infant or add a backpack like you see Cass doing here. Put some weight on those glute bridges. That's eight rounds in a row. Again, all of glute bridges. Then we're transitioning one more time to your other arm. You're holding the other arm for the full eight rounds, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds rest. So let's say I did my right arm for the first single arm plank, then I did my glute bridges, now I'm doing my left arm for all of these planks. And then finally, not final, sorry. Fourth movement, we have flutter kicks. So just fluttering like this. Notice how Cass's hands are on the ground out in front of her. This would be like uh, the easiest version. Um, if you wanna bring your hands back overhead like this, the further your hands get away from your core behind you, the harder it's gonna be. So we'll count right and left as one. So right, right kick, left kick is one rep. Then our final movement, why don't you use Judah for this one? Object ground to overhead. So, like the playground to overhead, we're going ground, up, and overhead, good. Down to the floor, up, and over, good. So I'll take him, show him in the backpack. Once again, using the pack for this, just going from the ground, all the way up, overhead. I really love the backpack for this movement. Add your water bottles, add your sandbags, add any weights you have and this is gonna be a really great finisher. All right, hope you guys enjoy this one. Yeah, way to go mom. All right, see you guys later.